Hey, it's 64 Bassman. I'm here on the pirate trip, and I got a little training to do with one of my little pirate people. Gotta go right down here and talk to this guy. Ahoy, well, uh, ahoy there, Swabby. As for today, uh, 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 um, I am your superior, Nico. Now, I promise I'll go easy on you, so. You do as I say, okay? Right now, first off, you have to take the test. All new pirates have to take. It's a bit of a doozy, so get ready. You watch everything I'm about to show you real careful, like, so you can cram it into your no doubt mushy swabby brain. Okay then. First off, you gotta press the switch. This is the easy part. Just walk up to it and run on it. Now check it out. After the platforms rise up from the floor, you gotta jump on them. Wee. Okay, so I was able to jump to this first one myself, but the next one is too far, right? That's what you. That's when you gotta do this. If you jump right at the rope, you can grab onto it <coughs> and use the control stick to swing. Swing until you get close enough to the next platform and press A to let go and jump to it. One thing he doesn't tell you, you can hold R to stop it, then you can turn your direction and slide up and down. Okay, so do you think you get how to do it? You have to swing from platform to platform and try to get to the entrance of the room over there. Here's the platform. Here's the platform, little swabby. Platforms only stay raised for a little while, so if you don't get there by the time they drop, you have to start over. It'll probably take you at least one year before you're good enough to make it all the way here. One rough year, one tough year, full of bumps and bruises. Of course, if you manage to do it faster, I'll reward you. Now give it a try. This ought to be good for a chuckle or two. It's fairly simple. I've failed before many times on here. For the first time I ever played this, of course. It was a pain in the ass. But just like that, first try. What? You did it already? Hmm. I I I'm proud to have you as as my as my under underling. I I wonder if it's okay just to give him that to that to him. I don't see why not. I doubt I'll get busted. All right, Swabby. I'll tell you what. You can have the treasure in the chest over there. It's your reward for the greatest and generous Nico. Or you take it before someone comes. Later on in the game, you'll get to come down here again and uh, do a hunt all air ups, of course. And I believe if you win, you get it, it's like ruby or something. But here, you, you got those spoils, bay. You can keep the items you get from enemies in this handy pouch. It can hold up to eight types of items. Press the blah 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 to see what's inside. And uh, yeah, whatever. Hey, Link, we've reached the Forsaken Fortress. Hurry up and get up here. Let's see, there should be rubies or something. Hmm. Give me all I got, Ruby. Come on, give me some rubies, would you? Uh, oh, shit, there's one right there. 21 rubies so far. N Damn, I didn't want to talk to you. What's funny is these still haven't gone down. <laughs> They're supposed to be timed. I'm not actually sure if they... Pretty sure they go down, but I haven't seen them go down just because I'm so good. 
at doing this, so I haven't seen it happen in forever. Yeah, that guy will tell you you can't go through there except the Tetris quarters or whatever. So you're not allowed to be in there. Okay, so... Hey, let Link. Uh, here I am, up here. Just get on the ladder. And just climb on up. Don't worry about talking to anyone else. And as you can see up there in the background. It's the Forsaken Fortress. What were you doing with Nico? Don't tell me you're playing some stupid game. For treasure, were you? Well, whatever. There's something you need to see. Have a look over there. That's the cursed is isle known as the Forsaken Fortress. Dun, 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 dun. There are all sorts of strange rumors about this place. What I do know is that long ago it used to be the hideout of a no good group of pirates we used to compete with. And there's a giant bird. But they were just small, just small time. Now the place looks like it's pretty dangerous. Ah, I knew it looked. Over there by the that window. Have you ever seen so many seagulls flock like that before? I bet you anything that the place where they've got your sisters locked up. But it looks like the whole place is under a really tight guard. This won't work. We'd be spotted before we got anywhere near the landing there. Hmm. What do we do now? She got an idea. Oh god. And I'm just sitting in a barrel. And it's on the catapult. Look, don't struggle. If you really want to go into a dangerous place like that, this is the only way to do it. Trust me. We pirates do this all the time. Don't worry about it. It'll be a piece of cake. And he just sits there and shakes in the barrel like, come on. Is everybody ready? Never you fear, kid. We're pros. We're going to launch you good. Three, two, one. Launch. And he missed and hit the wall. And my sword goes flying. Isn't that wonderful? And I land in the water. And somehow I'm still alive. The Forsaken Fortress. The Fortress. And he's like, ah, oh, this sucks. Yeah. Sure, I had to go get a shield, but what do you know? She made me lose my sword. Your sword landed all the way up there. Shoot, I'm sorry, I apologize. I guess my aim was off by a little bit. Hee <laughs> hee. The look on your face, priceless. Heh <laughs> heh, I slipped this stone into your pocket just before we fired. You over there, it's no ordinary stone either. I can see what you're doing through this stone, and obviously you can hear me through it, so if you're see the A buttons are flashing. We better press that button. I'll put the stone on your crustet screen. Press start and use L, L or R to scroll around. It's pretty basic. Hey, but listen carefully. I need this back after you save your sister, so don't go losing it, you understand? Huh, now that we're in here, let's see, you need this barrel here. You gotta go climbing up these stairs. Don't get caught by the light. I'm gonna go this way first. Just pretty sure there's a light up here you can turn off. Pretty sure at least. I'll go fast, fast, faster. Um, yeah, right up there. Okay, you take the barrel off and roll your ass up here. 
And they still have Listen up, Link. There's a monster running that searchlight up there. If you can slay the monster, then just maybe it'll shut the searchlight down. Oh, but you're unarmed, aren't you? All you have is a shield. If I were you, I'd try to use my shield to deflect a monster's blows and see if I could make it drop its weapon. If you did that, you could pick up its weapon with A. But that's just me. What'll you do? I am not going to do that. I'm actually going to pick up a weapon in the corner. It's much smarter. Cool, the monster didn't hear, and I can just sneak up on him. And now he's detected me, and the lights go up like that. So, prepare to fight. Moan, die. There we go, you're dead. Don't need that weapon anymore, because I'll end up finding another one later. Okay, now I gotta go down my... Yeah, the only search that you technically have to uh, turn off is that one. Otherwise, you're like screwed on actually getting anywhere. Um, actually, I'm gonna do something here. Um, um, let's see if I can land right. Oh, I can't actually sit there, can I? Well, I need to go up there so I can turn that one off. So, uh, I'm going. Gotta go through this door. Yeah, nothing up there. Yeah. I need to go through here. I'm pretty sure here. And then I gotta go find a ladder to climb up to the top so I can turn that search light on. Very simple process. Um, I think this is right above the jail, actually. You can get thrown in jail for, for one thing or another. Let's. Yeah, jail's right here. I'm not actually sure if there's. You know, there's nothing in there, but if you come this way, there's a chest that you could get. So. I'm just gonna go ahead and get that real quick. And. I don't quite remember what's inside. Ah, the dungeon map. Wonderful. Green areas are the ones you visited, flashing areas is the current location. I'm gonna go through here. Should be a ladder right there. There. This is the quickest way to get here. Obviously you gotta go through so many levels of downstairs first. Come on, see what I mean? All these ladders are freaking tall. Okay, the weapons are over there. Pick that up. Throw it. Pick one up. And come around behind it. Ha, ah, you bitch. Come at me, bro. Pathetic little bitch. Fuck you. Oh, sure, as soon as I try and pick it up, that's when you hit me. Oh, what? That should have killed me. There, now, yeah, no matter what, now he's dead. Okay, now I just go ahead and jump down here where I was. And I go through here. Do I dare try and get it? No. I'll, I'll go do that later. I can get that some other time. But go through here. Oh shit, I'm running low on time. Okay, so you want to go jumping across here. <coughs> um, here, I think I might up, end up being outside. Or, uh, or, wait, no, I don't need to be outside. I don't know. Now you gotta keep going to get to the right route, which I think I'm close to. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. This is 64 Fast Man. Thanks for watching.